Hello everyone. Good morning. And uh, today we are going to discuss about uh, HR report sheet creation. And this task is given for the human resource interns here at Universal Tribes. So here we got the task in the group today. And as you can see here, there is a sheet link for the reference. And next is create a sheet in this format using your UT mail ID. So all the HR interns, whoever are working with Universal Tribes, uh, they have already created the mail id uh, for their work uh, purpose at universal tribes so here you can see uh, firstly what we will do we'll op uh, we'll open google sheets app if you guys don't have google sheets app in your mobile phone you can download the google sheets app so here you can see like this the google sheets app will be if we open the google sheets app so like this the app will open and you need to switch to your UT mail ID before opening this uh, sheet. Uh, so after switching to UT mail ID, so like this, uh, the sheets app will be and you need to click on the plus button below. So here you have two options, choose template and new spreadsheet. You need to click on new spreadsheet. So after clicking on new spreadsheet, so untitled sheet will open like this. Then again, go back to WhatsApp where you got the task. Go back to WhatsApp where you got the task. And here, click on the sheet link. Uh, here, there is a sheet link. Uh, click on the sheet link and you can open it. So after opening the sheet, so like this, you will have the headings and you need to copy the row number one. After copying this headings, then you can go back to the sheet whichever you have opened right now the blank sheet and here just paste the headings in this row number one okay so after this firstly we'll update the untitled sheet to the title properly once we check the title how we need to update title uh, once we go back to the whatsapp group where we got the task so here in this task, if we scroll down, title of the sheet, your name, then followed by team VR. That means if the intern is belonging to team VR, the, based on the manager, manager will tell you uh, which one you need to write in the title. So for example, here the people uh, of sales HR interns are belonging to team uh, VR, the manager. So they will write team VR here. And then uh, these people are working in the October batch. So they will write October 22 because this is 2022. Okay. So here uh, then we'll uh, as uh, we have mentioned the example also be, uh, below. If the HR name is Rajkumar, then his report sheet title as follows. Rajkumar followed by team VR and October 2022. Okay. So we'll go back to the sheet. Uh, and uh, click on the three dots above here you have this untitled spreadsheet you guys need to click on this untitled spreadsheet and you need to make changes here so as uh, rajkumar is the hr intern so what uh, we will update here firstly we'll write rajkumar here then we'll separate by line then as mentioned in this task, if we look at the task, so what we have mentioned here in the title. So next you need to update that only. Team VR is the next word. So here uh, team VR is the next word. And as uh, Rajkumar is working in the October uh, batch project. So OCT and year is 2022. So then we'll write. 22 here and then click on ok and then click on ok so then uh, firstly we need to give access so click on three dots above again and then uh, you have the option of share and export and you need to click on share and export mm -hmm. then first option is share and you need to click on share option and after clicking on share here only you need to write rajkumar at the rate universal .com. And carriers at the rate universal .com. or else at that point of time, whoever the manager is working in this uh, project, you can write their mail ID and they will tell you uh, their mail IDs and you need to up update this mail IDs here. 
and access should be editor and then you need to click on send message then you need to click on send message so like this your report sheet will be shared with your manager and the next is here uh, after uh, adding people into your sheet then again you need to click on this three dots and copy the sheet link and share the sheet link with your manager copy link option is there copy it and share the link with your manager on their whatsapp chat okay so after sharing with your manager on their whatsapp so now we'll discuss about the headings which you go which we got here as you can see here first is serial number then followed by name of the sales and marketing intern then contact number of sales and marketing intern then personal mail id then date of joining date of leaving offer letter sent offer acceptance received reason for termination sales amount order number active in week one active in week two active in week three active in week four and a pitching sheet link then followed by referral link and commission amount okay we'll uh, look at this uh, sheet with an example right now so if we go back to the serial number one so first is here we will write serial number one like hr uh, intern will update this sheet with the details of his or her sales and marketing interns for example rajkumar is the hr intern and his uh, sales and marketing intern name is vandana singh so he will write Vandana Singh details here. Vandana Singh. Then followed by contact number of Vandana Singh. For example, we are writing here 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 only. And but here you guys need to update your interns uh, details properly. And next is mail ID of Vandana Singh. So here we will write mail ID of Vandana Singh. So we'll enter the mail ID here. So Vandana at the rate gmail.com. Just an example. So we'll write here and after this date of joining, for example, Vandana joined this uh, sales and marketing internship in the month of October. So sorry, in the month of November. So she will uh, like the HR person will update with the first of November she joined. So 01. Okay, you can write 01 then followed by 11 then followed by 2022 and this year she joined. So here like this date of joining. And date of leaving HR person can update later, not uh, right now. If the person leaves in between or else if she or he completed the internship successfully, then they can enter this date of leaving uh, as the sales and marketing internship is for one month. So after completion of one month or else when person leaves in between, they can update this. Next is offer letter sent. Whether Vandana Singh got the offer letter or not. For example, Vandana Singh got the offer letter. So then hr person will update yes here and whether hr person received the offer letter acceptance or not if received then write yes then reason for termination or leaving the internship for suppose in between vandana singh left the internship for so and so reason maybe due to exam maybe due to health issues or else for uh, any other so then hr person will write here and next is sales amount for example vandana singh made uh, sales of 2000 rupees Today she made two sales of 2000 rupees. So here HR person will write 2000 rupees and tomorrow she made a sale of 500 rupees. So then HR person will write 2000 plus 500. That means 2500 here in this uh, sales amount. Uh, directly you can write 2500 because total amount is 2500. So 2500 here HR person will write and order numbers as the vandana singh made two sales so order numbers uh, here hr person will update by asking the sales and marketing intern for order numbers so one is hashtag 12345 one is hashtag 12346 for example example only okay so like this two order numbers hr person will update here in this sheet next is active in week one 
and vandana singh is actively participating in all the tasks and she completed all the promotional activities and attending the sessions in the week one so here hr person will write the evaluation yes uh, she was active in the week one and she completed all the tasks properly and attended all the sessions if she is not active or uh, taking a leave in between or not responding properly then hr person will update this week one activity according to that so same goes with the week two week three and week four so next coming to this pitching sheet uh, link so here your sales and marketing interns will have the pitching sheet uh, creation task so here already vandana singh submitted pitching sheet link to uh, his hr mentor so he will update that only here directly and next is referral link so there is a refer and earn program currently going on for all the sales and marketing interns so hr person will collect the referral link uh, from the sales and marketing intern and update here so vandana singh already submitted the referral link to his hr her hr mentor so her hr mentor will update this referral link here and next is commission amount what uh, hr mentor will do hr mentor will ask uh, vandana singh regarding her uh, affiliate dashboard so on that dashboard commission amount will be visible for example commission amount is 375 rupees so she will write 375 rupees here okay so like this you guys need to update all the interns details very properly with a date of joining and proper mail id proper and full name of your intern phone number of your intern and pitching sheet link and referral link also you need to update and commission amount also if your intern made any sales okay so like this you need to update and uh, once after updating this just click on the tick mark above so like this regularly you guys need to update your uh, main sheet and whenever you face any problems you can reach out to your hr or else hr manager who are handling you so thanks for watching this video have a nice day take care